Hey guys, it's Gabe here from Gabe's Lego Productions, and this is our update on the Kashyyyk Mock. Well, we decided a few days ago that this was going to be our home base and that we were going to keep working on it and updating you about every week. So, first we'll start with the front here. And, uh, I, uh, um, I removed the water so I could use the base plate that was under it. And I added two turrets and I put this tree on top right there. Then we have the courtyard, and then um, if you come in this door right here, that one right there, you have the uh, table where everybody eats, and then you have the bar of C. Prepio um, serving. Oh, and CJ's here, by the way. Say hi, CJ. Hey, guys. And uh, also, we have, this is, the, uh, this is the base, and this is advancing droids, and these are the commanders, Gree, Rex, Wolfie and two custom commanders I made. And then if you go through that blue door right there, you have a airing vent that CJ made that fits on right there. And then you have a guy, these guys, the Kashyyyk Troopers, they are uh, returning in for the night. And then this door right here, this is a door. This is going to lead to the um, medic bay in the future. Then, we have the armory, which you guys saw last time, with the Red Squad cleaning. And then we have some sliding doors right here. Just control, controlled by yourself, and then give you give you on that. Okay. Then, to the hangar bay. This took us a while, guys, to get this um, all situated and get it all planned out. We had a different format originally, but we decided to do this format instead. So, we'll start from the front and work our way back. So, this is a custom speeder with a clone inside there that you can get the glimpse of the legs. It's on a uh, clear glass Lego pole. And it it's just a starship that I made with two engines and a central one. Here, I can just take it off. Uh, uh, the piece goes right there. Uh, this, this is a pretty visual format if you want to make it yourself. It's just got hinge pieces right there for the wings. Place that there. Then we have a... This is a actual Lego set. Uh, Shadow Troopers, I think it was. Hold on, I'll get the number on it. Uh, no, that's fine, CJ. Um, Shadow Troopers... That's an actual Lego set. I, the pilot is actually not in the Lego set, but yeah. Um, this is this is our Medi squad right here for now. Then we have this is also a set, but I customize it, and I customize all the clones are in it. Here, I'll give you a good look at one clone right here. It's got a yellow body with black feet, a yellow stripe down the side with black all around it, and then a white yellow I mean yellow stripe on the helmet. That's the same for all, and then in the front, I've customized it in yellow. And a review will be coming out on both of these sets soon, guys. And then we have the Swarm Speeder. I will also be doing a review on this set. Uh, yeah. And this, this is kind of a tank CJ made. Um, I This is originally a walker, but CJ kind of made it into a tank. And that's the pilot for it right there. And then this is also a set which I am also going to be reviewing. With Commander Nail, but I bought two, so like, um, because Bark Troopers actually they don't have any custom, ma uh, like markings to, s to signify the commander. Correct me if I'm wrong, wrong in the comments, but uh, these I have blast blasters that right here that missiles fit in, but I'll be showing more of that on the uh, in the review. So this is our Medi station right now for here for n for n right here for now. Uh, this clone has an injured cut off hand, and then it's a, uh, yeah, and then it's a, uh, Medi thing, and CJ Melee Trooper. CJ just made this cool little, um, this is actually not a clone, this, is this, is, this is a clone? Um, it could, it could be clone or a Death Watch, but. Okay, this is my custom Death Watch figure. Uh, Darth Maul Death Watched. 
By the way, guys, during this video, we will I will be adding stuff in, so... Yeah. Don't, also, if you guys just see stuff randomly, randomly being put in random spots, it's just me adding new stuff to the base. Okay, and so this is my custom Deathwatch minifig. Uh, pretty simple. Just, uh... I just use all pieces from the Deathwatch character, but uh, except for the legs, I use different red legs. And just sharpie it. Then this kind of tank missile. It's a it's a small hover speeder. Hover speeder. Uh, I got two cannons on the side and a little cockpit. Don't confuse the Death Watch with clones, guys. So, uh, so I think that's it for the bay. If I'll see if I missed anything. Oh, right. And guys, what I did, this is some, these are some weapons, too, that I made. I made two, uh, what? Can I take them apart? I made two, uh, rocket launchers from LEGO Star Wars 3, the video game. And it's really simple. So, it's just a telescope piece, two of those pieces. Here, I'll give you a view of what those look like. Two of, two of those pieces, one on the front and one on the back, and then just a regular pistol. Uh, actually, I'll, I'll I'll save the other weapons for another time. Uh, I think our the, I don't know if the sleeping beds, are, but I'll show you the what I use for the beds. I got all these pieces, guys, from the Lego store. So uh, yeah. I got one, I have this, just, this is just a, uh, six by two, and then it has two, uh, headlamps for a pillow, and then some white sheets. Put that back right there. And then, uh, I think that's it for the base, but CJ earlier today did make a mini mock that he wanted me to show. So... This is not from the Clone Wars. This is from the Imperial Age. This is supposed to signify, hopefully, if there is some scene, this might be a scene in the new movie. It's not, I guess, it's just a random thing. But it is basically a Sith Lord walking up to one of the Rebels leaders. It could be a, a, in Quincy. It's a, it's a prison. It's okay. One. So this is it. a Inquisitor, probably. This is just the custom Inquisitor that I made. Not the Inquisitor, just a Inquisitor. And two Shadow Troopers. And then this is a re liftable top, just an air vent like the one over there that I showed you. And then you have a Rebel Leader inside. So, yeah. Um, Is that all, CJ? Did I cover everything? You can see what I'm working on. But it won't look very pretty. Okay, CJ is looking on what looks like a custom... It's another little speeder. It's another little speeder. So we'll show that in the next episode along with some guns and some custom minifigs. And I'll go through um some sets. Okay, guys, be on the lookout for more reviews on the LEGO Star Wars sets from Star Wars Rebels, uh, Star Wars... Uh... I have one thing to say. Now, I know... There's not a lot of viewers. I know Aiden. Yeah, I'm speaking to Aiden. Uh, please, guys, if you want to see more of us or you want to see something that we build in our creations, subscribe. Because once we, once we start getting subscribed, 